Welcome back everyone. In this video I'm going to talk about how you can install Emacs in what is arguably the most popular Linux distribution, Ubuntu. And uh, this should also work in Xubuntu and Lubuntu and some of the other variations that you can download and install. Hey everybody, just wanted to remind you that there's never really been a better time to get yourself the official Ask Me About My Org Mode Agenda t-shirt in a variety of colors and sizes. Or you might be interested in the coffee mug or sweatshirt. Tell the world you're a based Emacs user with the rad Ask Me About My Org Mode Agenda merch. The official merch of my channel. Link will be below in the description if you want to check it out. Thank you for watching the commercial. Now for a while, to get the latest and greatest version of Emacs, I would use the GNU Geeks installation method. And uh, GNU Geeks is a package manager that you can use, and um, it's, it's command line based. Um, and I believe there's also a Linux distribution uh, where it actually has its own fully, fully functional operating system and everything. Um, but for today, I wanted to show you an easier way because now in the uh, package manager that comes uh, in the Ubuntu software center here, you can actually get the latest version of Emacs. So uh, let's actually just, um, let's just double check here what the latest is, right? But let's actually look up uh, Emacs current version using the, the Google, the Google search engine. So 28.2. Uh, okay, so let's, uh, let's close that and let's look up Emacs here. And you want to make sure to read because here's Emacs terminal. That is, of course, the, the, the terminal variant of Emacs. We want the GUI. We want the, the, the full window experience and everything. But if we click on this first one that comes up, if you scroll down, you see it's 27.1. Uh, that's a version I've been using for a long time, and it's, it's, it's pretty fine. It, it does like a lot of the things you see in my other videos. So that's not a big deal if you want to install that one. But if you want the more current one, you can go down a little bit and you see this one here. This is GNU Emacs. And if you scroll down, 28.2. So, um, and there's more information here about uh, these uh, these different apps. But uh, so if I just click install right there, just gotta put in my, my password and it's gonna start installing Emacs. So um, I've installed Emacs very different ways over the years. Uh, there was a, a time where I was actually compiling it from the from the source code and everything, and uh, it was always, I was chasing down packages that I was missing and stuff. So the, these nice packaged uh, installation uh, versions that you can get are definitely convenient. Uh, and this is uh, if you're if you don't want anything too extremely customized, this is a great way to get the current the current version of Emacs. And uh, you can start working. I believe in Ubuntu here, you can click the, the super key, just type in Emacs, and there it is. Very cool. So now, and let's just double check. You can do uh, meta X, alt X, and type in version. And there you go, the new Emacs 28.2. Pretty fancy. And uh, you got your org mode set up, and you can go org crazy and watch my videos to learn how to do that. But otherwise, you're you're ready to go. I would say if you're new to Emacs and new to all this stuff, you can always just click on the Emacs tutorial here, follow along, and you'll get up to speed. Well, I'm going to leave it there because that's uh, that's a lot for one day. We've got Emacs installed. We're ready to get busy, get down and do some dirty org mode. And of course, if you want to see more about that, you can watch my videos and get all up to speed. Uh, but there you go. I'm going to leave it there. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time.